If you can't already tell by the title, I have a pretty huge announcement regarding this channel and its future content and what I'm going to be dedicating my life and energy to for the next few months. And yeah, why don't we just get into it? So as many of you know, when I first started this channel, I started a channel with Spider-Man 1 and Spider-Man 2 all the way to 7, which was the arguably better episode of the entire series of my little Sam Raimi inspired uh, childhood. And I had a lot of fun doing that stop motion series, I won't lie to you at all. And here's the thing, I felt like since the majority of the series that I had of Spider-Man, uh, was mainly me as a kid having fun and I finished it off with such a serious kind of like mentality put in behind it I decided why don't I take that mentality and actually put it into a rebooted kind of series for Spider-Man and I decided to do that so here is the official announcement of Spider-Man Empire State. Now, let's talk about the release date. This release date has been pushed back so many times. I believe I've been working on this for three months, give or take. And I know you guys have been waiting for like the first episode or even a glimpse or a trailer of the proof that, that it's even being made. And if you follow me on Twitter and Instagram, you'll see that I've been posting updates regarding it. And I've also been posting clips, a little bit of clips where the action is actually happening. And yeah, it, I've been updating you guys, so be sure to follow me there if you want to see more about this. And I've also had friends um, hop on this project as well, which means they've been lending their voices to me so I can add them as characters, which means this series will have voice acting, which means more work has been put into script. So as far as why it's taking so long to come out, it's because I'm a one-man team. I handle the editing, I handle the writing of the story, the writing of the script, the creation of the thumbnail, uh, and the animation. I do all of that by myself, as well as the editing. And it can be very taxing at times, you know. There's there's times where I don't want to film because of uh, either I'm too tired, because I do have currently a job that takes a majority of my energy away. So that's kind of a huge contributor to me not finishing this on time and pushing it back so many times. It's because of that. However, I feel like this, since I changed the scenery, because at first I was filming in a very small spot. Let me show you. Um, Over here, I was filming the entirety of the series. Um, Not the entirety, but at least the intro part. And when I stopped doing that, because listen, I couldn't work with the space I was forcibly, forcing myself to work on. I didn't have to. Um, work on that spot I started working on the table and it got so much easier to do um, the animation because I had more space and I could work quicker with the space that I had and yeah I managed to finish uh, I'm pretty sure the majority and if not the entire um, intro to the series and you know I'm very happy that we're going with that you know speed now so this shouldn't take more than two more weeks to get completely done and I feel like we should be good after that. However, how, as far as how this series is coming out, it's coming out pretty great in my opinion. Um, the voice actors have been wondering when I'm gonna release the episode. Trust me guys, it's coming out soon. I've also been working with 3.5 inches um, tall figures such as this one, which is the main action figure that I'm going to be using for this series that I just feel like they're more convenient when I make the props for it which by the way let's talk about props I would have usually filmed the props or like any background type of thing with the green screen now the green screen is a double-edged sword it works really well to get rid of like the background you can add one of your own let's say a city and back behind the spider-man um I did that once successfully, however, the next three scenes that I filmed, which by the way, individually, a scene can take up to upwards two to probably more hours to film a single motion. Imagine my dismay when I finish recording approximately three scenes with the green screen only for me to be unable to remove the green behind them because whenever I did, the chroma would leave a bunch of fuzz and trust me guys, I tried like hell to save the footage, eventually I just couldn't. And I had to scrap them all, which also um, held me back on finishing the first episode because I was unable to get the chroma correctly as well as the shading because I film everything on a specific device. And sometimes when I did the stop motion, the pixels would move and therefore the, the chroma wouldn't be able to tell if it's just the lighting that's moving around or if it's the same color. And it sucks that I've had to waste a lot of time, which could have been dedicated to me actually doing it the way I used to do which was creating props for the series 
or doing something that manually instead of relying so much on the tech that we have now. And I started doing that and we started picking up the pace as much as possible. And by we, I mean I, because I'm still a one man team. As far as everything else, I just recently, I'm pretty sure completed the entire introduction of the series or of the first episode. I finished that and it is expected to release in two weeks if not three give or take i hope it, it it comes out soon but it's definitely coming out this month i just i had a lot to do <laughs> this month as well so again i thank everyone for their patience as well as the actors because they are anxious to see this to come out to see how it comes out and everything and i understand because i'm also lending my voice in this project and i have to make sure that everything comes out well at the end of the day but yeah this is the official announcement of the series expect the first episode or if not the trailer at least in two weeks or three and if you follow my other socials for example my instagram and my twitter link in the description you will be getting updates regarding this series and you'll know when the official date for one of the episodes is coming out on there so i hope you guys do heed that warning and I hope you follow me there because I promise you guys you won't miss a thing if you do. Anyways, that's all I have for today's video. I hope you guys are excited for this and I hope you enjoyed today's video. Um, and yeah, that's all I've got to say for today's video. Much love and peace.